Weekly character trailers are here, with the release date of Tekken 8 quickly approaching us. There's honestly not much time left before we can all get our hands on this game, but there's a slight problem that we gotta talk about. When this game releases, there will be 32 fighters in the base roster, with Reyna being announced last week as the final fighter, until the DLC of course. Now the developers have stated that we'll be getting a new character gameplay trailer every week. But here's the problem. This game is set to release January 26, 2024, and I'm posting this video on November 21st. Now, if I'm not mistaken here, I did the math, and it puts us 10 weeks away from this game's release. So with the game being 10 weeks away, but us having 11 characters left in the roster, how's this gonna work out? Now, we don't have a set date or time of when we're gonna get a trailer for each of these characters, so we don't know exactly when they'll be released. But still, that means even if they drop a character trailer today, they will be one trailer short by the time the game is released. So how's that gonna work out? Unless on one one week they decide to drop two character trailers which I don't think that would really work and dropping a character trailer the day or a week after the game is released wouldn't really make sense because that trailer needs to have time to make its rounds on the internet which I guess another question would be which characters are going to be shown first and which one will be saved for last but the characters yet to get trailers are Yoshimitsu, Steve, Dragonov, Leo, Kuma, Shaheen, Panda, Zafina, Lee, Alyssa, and finally Devil Jin. So that's quite a few characters we got there. I feel like the only way they can get around this is if they drop like a release date trailer, which is also a character's gameplay trailer. And if they were to do that, I feel like the character they'd pick would be Devil Jin. He's one of the more popular characters and he plays a huge part in the story. Or another possibility could be maybe Kuma and Panda share a trailer, which honestly I wouldn't be a fan of that since they're both portrayed as separate fighters. Nonetheless, Harada is making us wait patiently for these trailers. But that's enough out of me. Let me know what you guys think the Tekken team is up to in the comments down below. As always, thank Thank you so much for watching if you're not yet subscribed please consider it it really helped the channel out but until next time you'll see me in the next video